Uh, help out the old friend's sleeping bear. Nobody knows whatever happened to him. Let's get back to this one now. I'm going to keep trying my agility runs because I think those will work out just fine. Ooh, a mini boss. I'm going to keep going agility, man. You can't stop me. This one even has a key. Keep doing it. Did I pop up as one of the Honkai people yet? No. It says three people have installed, which was an anonymous user, which I'm pretty sure is Lodima, Paul, and Colts. Is it like Darkest Dungeon? I don't think it's as good as Darkest Dungeon, but I'm pretty sure it also is like a turn-based game. Which I am a fan of. I've been playing, um... Uh, Rogue Waters off-stream a little bit yesterday, which I've been really getting into, which is a tactics turn-based game. Yo, he evolved. I like my tactics, man. That's what I've learned about myself. I, is it MMO? I, I, I genuinely don't know. You like turtles? I fuck with turtles too, Slurms. I fuck with turtles too. I guess we're gonna go for the agility again. This is a mini boss. Agility all night long. It markets itself as an MMORPG, does it? I'm gonna get that Quiet Place game next week. Ain't gonna be good, but I'll mess with it. Quiet Place? Wait, the freaking movie's Quiet Place? They have a game? Is it as bad as the King Kong game? Can't be as bad as the King Kong game, right? Should I just like not even go for arrows and just let the quivers be? Save the rerolls. Get some poison. The controller mic, you think, to monitor your sound? The controller mic? But how many... Oh god, I almost just fucking threw my controller. How many controllers have a mic? I know the PlayStation one has one. Does the Xbox controller have a mic? <clears throat> Leave the shop. Hey, big boy. I might just go for agility like weapons that are not. The bleed's doing some damage. Yeah, but we killed it. Holds infinite arrows. I mean, dude, like, I don't have any bows. I mean, this is true. Everything does listen to us. Everything is always listening. Hmm. 
Eh, uh, skip it. Skip it! I want my first run to be an agility run. Reloads when adjacent to quivers. Hmm. I'm not gonna go for the quivers. I'm gonna go for stabbies. So I'll be I'll have to get rid of my quivers, but that's fine. I feel like more HP is gonna be a necessity. I also feel like not going for arrows is going to be weird with a, a build like this. Unlock Django by defeating the total of 25 elite enemies. Adds one arrow to all quivers. Like that would probably be pretty good. Store 7 HP when health is not full, 3 uses. I'll give one reroll. Poison, sure. We now have a roguelite poker and a roguelite slots. When are we going to have a roguelite roulette? There is a roguelite roulette called Bingo Bangle. Bingo Bangle. And there's also a blackjack roguelite called Dungeons and Degenerate Gamblers. I think that game is actually top tier, though. Bingo, ba or Bingo Bingle. Bingo, bingle, bingle. But it does exist. Now store it. Just an extra spot, so... Dom, yeah, there's also Luck Be a Landlord, which is more slots. Peglin is Pachinko. So here's are the here's the games that are simple games that turned into roguelites. There's Poker with Balatro, that's the biggest one. There's Peglin with Pachinko. That's kind that's a pretty big game, in my opinion. I love Peglin. Luck Be a Landlord, Slot Machines. This game, Slot Machines. Dungeons and Degenerate Gamblers, uh Blackjack. Rack and Slay is a pool roguelite. And Bingle Bingle is Roulette. So there's seven of them off the top of my head. Seven of them off the top of my head. And then there's also a few chest roguelites with uh, Shotgun... Shotgun King, the final checkmate. Atomicrops is a shooting farming roguelite. There's a couple farming roguelites out there. Atomicrops. Uh, there's also um, Pesticide Not Required, but that's a Horde Survivor Farmer. I think I got a good amount of Shinobi weapons. I don't have a key, so... More shinobi weapons will be good. I got three shinobis. Shuffleboard. I mean, I don't know all of them. Obviously, I don't know all of them, but I just know they all exist out there. Heals 30 HP. I'm not going for arrows this time around, which is unfortunate because I need armor. Can I reroll? 
Oh, for God's sakes. The one time I'm not going for the arrows, I'm getting so many quivers. One more. Shield's good. I, I, I always need armor, so I'll take a shield. Can always use some armor. Bruce might be a hard cookie to beat. Tough cookie with a long history for breaking little hearts like the one in me. Now, if I have two of these, do they both store all the shinobi weapons? Or should I just take the shinobi shuriken? So my one is already going to be doing more. I'll just take the I'll just take the shuriken to be safe. I still don't have a key, so I'm just gonna go top top row. I mean, I'll take that for now. More armor is always good. More armor is always good. If there's anything I've learned in my few times of playing this game, it's I get destroyed. Oh my god, he has so many goddamn status effects on me. I'll do a reroll. Ugh. If I was doing a bow run, man, this would be so good. Takes one arrow from all quivers. Oh, that would have been so good. This would have been so good with a bow run. But I did not do a bow run. And I'm still doing a good amount of damage. Apply six poison plus two poison for each flask in your inventory. I don't think I have any, but it's six more poison, so I only have 19. Oh my god, cat is up. Cat, I took a sponsorship again. Yes. And it's PC only for new players. I'm asking Kat since she plays Star Rail a lot. I think she plays it every day. Do you play it every day? She plays Star Rail like every day, so I was asking her how long it takes to get to level 40, and she was like, mm. She was like, yeah, it takes a while. And I was like, great. Because that's the highest reward in the... If someone gets the... It's... It, the, the sponsorship is not... It's not as good as Monopoly Go. I will say that. But... It's free, so, you know, might as well. You're 60. Yo, you got, like, an ult again? Like, if you look at this for the sponsorship, I'm not gonna advertise this too much. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not going to. Like, I, I, I'll obviously want to make money, but, like, level 40 is insane. I get a gifted sub every time somebody gets to level 40, so you get me 20 bucks and a gifted sub. But also, somebody new joined. Let's see who it was. Dive into Dream Woven Wonders. Yeah, dive into it. Who's the new gamer? 
Come on, I know there's a new gamer. Give it to me. Give it to me. I see it. There's a new one. There's a new one. Who am I calling out? Also, we have to take Stormy to the vet at 1230. You know this, though. Colts reached level three. Colts was the first one to reach level three. Thanks, Colts. Kayvon started the journey. Thanks, Kayvon, for starting your Honkai Star Rail journey. Thank you guys for joining me on Honkai Star Rail sponsorship. Uh, I owe Honkai Star Rail, and I saw the sponsorship available, so I was just like, fuck it. I'm just going to take a sponsorship. Finally, I can stop playing. No, get, get a higher level. You can make me more money. Don't you want to make me a bunch of money? Might as well take the food. What are you, the levels? Uh... Level 3, I get 5 bucks. Level 10, I get 8 bucks. Level 30, I get 14 bucks. Level 40. So there's not really that much. There's not really that much. It's level 3, 10, 30, 40. So there's not a crazy amount of incentives like there was for like Monopoly. One more reroll. Gonna skip. Seventy two, okay. There goes all my health. Fortified buff will be good. Reroll the shop. Man, if I was doing the goddamn bow run, the one time I'm like, let's not use the bows and quivers. I get so many. Why quiver if no bow? It's a good point. We can get rid of that. I didn't realize it was still hanging about. The one time I don't do it though, there's so fucking many bows. Oh, I was going to say, let's buy that golden apple, but... The one time! Whoa, this isn't the boss three that I know. This isn't Burr, this is An Ramat. Who the fuck is this guy? One. Oh, God. I do have 115 poison on them. Get five, get defeated five times. You gotta be kidding me, man. They had seven HP. I've unlocked every character besides one. I am winning a run with this goddamn agility. Maybe I need to take... Maybe I need to take the bows this time.
You might be better as an agility character, to be honest. You might be better as an agility character... ...than you. Alright, we'll do a strength build with this guy instead. We'll do a strength build with him. We'll go strength. We'll go strength. We'll just go right here. This is a freebie. Freebie. We're going strength, baby. Strength and armor. I'll just take a bomb. Ooh, rare symbol. Deal 100 damage every 5 spins. Cooldown resets on a leader boss kill. Triggers all diagonal axes. Oh, that could be pretty good. If I go for a lot of axes. But 100 damage every 5 spins? Hmm. I'm just thinking, if I have 20 items, this gets me 100 damage every 5 spins. Am I going to be averaging more than 20 damage for the double axe every spin? I'm going to take the double axe. This thing is going to suck eventually, the Rusty Cleaver, so... Kill the enemy in one spin without them performing any action. My bad. I'll take another bomb. You have the repair hammer already. It repairs adjacent weapons. Does it repair it back to full HP? Oh, initial value. So these things are just going to be really good if I can get adjacent and get them with the repair hammer, aka get lucky. It's going to be weird not having any poison because I've relied on poison so much. I'll just keep taking some armor. Ten armor? Pretty good. Three damage for each adjacent axe. Give me the wooden shield. Lots of treasure chest. Common symbol. Six damage, sure. Uncommon symbol. Restores initial damage values to rusty, broken, and primal weapons. All these are pretty good. Me discovering today that Waffle House is used to check the severity of natural disasters based if it's open or not. Americans. I think that's just more so a meme that people do. I've never been to a Waffle House, though. Never been to a Waffle House. And I don't think I want to go to a Waffle House. Rusty, Broken, and Primal. And I got two Rusties. That in Disney World. Good old Disney World. never closes for anything. I think we got Denny's where we are. We don't got Waffle House where we are, but we definitely got Denny's. Guess I'll take a regeneration ring. Jesus. We have Denny's, right, Kat? She said yes. We do have Denny's. 
We went there with the impatient platypus, because she's from the city we, we live in. She grew up here. You've never seen a Waffle House IRL? I don't even know if I've seen one IRL. I'll be honest, Waffle House is one of those things I really just don't care about. Really, I don't care about Waffle House. We don't have them in New England? Yeah, growing up in New England. I'll be, I, I'll say it. If you're living in the United States, Maybe I'm biased. I'm definitely biased. I think living in New England is probably the best place to be in the United States. Biased, most definitely. Ooh. Oh, that freaking armor would have been good. Where's a pancake person? I like either one, but... One reroll. Food is food, you know what I mean? I'll get rid of one of those. Oh, I didn't need to get rid of one of those, though, because I have a dynamite. damage for each adjacent axe. I mean, I'll keep getting the axes buffed, I guess. Let me check what time we have to catch a bus. It's at 1230, so I'll say we leave at 1115, because it takes probably an hour. Where to? Uh, the vet. Leave at... Okay, you want to check if we have money on our cards as well? I'll just say leave at 11.15 a.m. All right, there's an 11.25 bus that gets us there at 12.09. 20 minutes early, that's fine. 12.09, 20 minutes early, not a big deal. What bus, what time did I just say that was, 11.25? Yeah, 11.25. We catch an 11.25 bus. Which means it's a very short stream. What is up, Becca? Basically a slot machine roguelite. We are here. This is how society has evolved. This is how society has evolved. Public transportation must be nice. We live in a major city in Canada. I feel most major cities across Canada and the United States have public transportation. Major cities! Or like live adjacent to a major city so you can get public transportation to said major city. Uh, I will tell you, it is nice! I could probably get rid of the bread, to be honest. Honestly, skip it. We need to get some removes. Get rid of the bread. We don't really need that. Three double axes. Three rusty cleavers. Honestly, we'll keep everything the way it is right now. I do like that cookie. A sub-30 Peglin run last night? You were so excited. Well, you beat the game within 30 minutes? What difficulty were you on? If you were on a difficulty enhancer. Bro, 
Rusty, broken, and primal weapons. Fuck it, we ball. I'll try it out. Spin ball three. Crucible three? Gamer? Holy shit, you're a gamer in Peglin. Got an achievement. I'm a, I've am beaten Crucible 5. But I haven't played in like a week plus because I've just been busy. I've been really addicted to Shogun's Showdown at night. It gets hard to win Peglin runs when you have to... When you, uh... Have all that. The beefy steak. That's a long term heal. What up, Falcus? Welcome to the short stream. I'm sorry today is also a very short stream. I assume all of you understand why it's a short stream. Because you like cats. Is it because you hate me? No. Cat, you streaming today? Cat doesn't know if she's streaming. I'm probably gonna play Rogue Waters later. Dynamite. I'll take some dynamite. Is it a routine checkup? Yeah, it's just to get a vaccine and a health checkup. She's getting her second rabies shot, so she doesn't have to worry about it for a year. The shitty thing is, Nami has to go get her rabies shot on the 22nd, so we're just gonna be going to the vet so fucking much. But when Nami, when Nami gets her rabies shot, she's not going to have to worry about it for three years. Arrived safe at my family's house, ready to ride out the storm. Anybody else in FL Plaza stay safe. Thank you for the 200 bits, pirates. Stay safe, my friend. Stay safe. Yeah, after we're done with the vets in October, we won't have to go back for another year because Stormy's rabies shot. But Nami won't have to go back for three years, which is very nice. I got two things that are... I got one thing that's going to go away slowly. I'm going to get rid of the fucking common one. Thank you, pirate. Oh, man, the firecracker would have been really good. I do really like the life shard, but I don't really want to... Uh... That's not going to do much. He's riding out the storm on a cruise ship, but he may be tossing and turning on the waters. Ah, GC will be fine. I'm sure of it. Glad his cruise did not get canceled. Five power this battle? Jesus. Ten armor? Ten armor is pretty good. Alright, let's hope for the best here. Never beat this guy yet. It ain't starting yet. I should have bought the heal.
Wait. Bro, oh my god, he beats me every time. <laughs> He beats me every time. All right, we got time for one more run. We got time for one more run. I have every character unlock at least. Burr keeps whooping me, man. I'm gonna try another strength build. I'm gonna try another one. Maybe. Not doing magic. No hair. I don't have a hammer, so. Three damage for each Jason axe. Oh, I didn't have a key? Fuck me, I would have taken the key. I thought I had one. Oh, that's awkward. Take 80 gold, I guess. Being your window shutters. Hope you can stay safe. Hopefully you're not in the goddamn direct path of said storm. Eh, my great sword is already not that great. This one doesn't lose any health, so I guess I'll take that one. Eight armor and two thorns. Sure. Don't know what thorns do, but... Alright, restoring the value. We actually have a chance to save it now. Jason axes, two spiky shields, 80 gold, that's an investment. You're switching to subscription billing this November, says Patreon? What the fuck does that mean? I did not switch anything, Patreon. You're trying to make me change something that I didn't want to change. rid of those debuffs. So when they attack me, I'm dealing 24 damage, 28 damage because of my thorns? Infinite uses on the chest. Ooh, we're going down this bottom path then. We got infinite uses on a chest. want someone to be risky. I mean, they're the ones door dashing food out in the, they're in a hurricane or a tropical storm, you know? All right. I feel like the spiky shields could be pretty good. 10 armor? Sure. Uh, 
deals 60 damage, loses 10 damage after each attack. Give it a shot. I just need the hammer to line up with it. Uh, we'll use one reroll. Rusty Axe. I need this hammer to line up, man. Epic! Ooh, 15 armor and 5 thorns. Alright, we're going with a thorn run, it seems. Removing these two symbols. Guys, make sure you join Honkai Star Rail for the Burr stream if you want to. There's four of you in here. If you install the game as a new player, you get me five bucks. If you get to level three, you get me five bucks. If you get to level ten, you get me eight bucks. Let's spin. We might have ourselves a thorn run. Honestly, just give me the rusty greatsword. Instantly kills regular enemies. Applies five weakness and frail. I'll take the apply and the weakness. started a sponsorship on it yeah i checked the sponsorships today and there was one available that started today and it was brand new it lasts 30 days total so i was like fuck it i will take this sponsorship i guess i said fuck it so here we are And here we are. Honestly, I'll skip. Having two hammers, I feel like, will be good. Higher chance. Five weakness and frail. Give me the, fr the frail and weakness. And it's on PC only, so you have to play it on PC if you do end up playing it. All right, we'll uh, fight the boss. We're on fight number two, Shag Zar. Don't worry, we're getting lots of spikes. Well, I could apply some weakness to you. So you do a lot less damage and gain a lot less armor. Which will probably be useful on the final boss. Resets cooldown of adjacent weapons. Give me two clock swords. On January 1st of this year, I tell you at some point in 2024, you're going to do a Genshin type game sponsorship. Your response is what? No shot. I didn't expect Genshin. I didn't expect Honkai Star Rail to be the game that landed on the wheel. In my defense, if Honkai Star Rail didn't land on that wheel, I would not be playing Honkai Star Rail. One damage for every three missing mana points. Deals 20 damage every two spins plus five damage for each symbol that has exploded this run. I think I should probably sell the axes. I don't think the axes are helping too much. Yeah, a little Lotus Dragon put Honkai Star Rail on. They asked if any gotcha games were available. And I was like, the only one will be Honkai Star Rail. And when I said that, I was like, there's no way Honkai Star Rail is going to land. Literally, I said, there's no way in my head. And well, clearly that did not work out in my favor.
clearly did not work out in my favor. People don't have to love it. I will stream it. I'll probably stream it tomorrow. Just to get it done and get my, uh, my community service of it out of the way. Should probably get rid of this key. I don't know what ZZZ is. I don't know what type of game it is. I at least know what type of game Star Rail is. I got him. Comes the new Marvel Snap era. That, I can promise you, will not happen. Listen, I don't know about you guys. I'm waiting for October 20th to come up so we can all have a great time with good old Darkest Dungeon. Good old Darkest Dungeon. It's more action combo combat. I don't know if I would like that. I'm gonna get rid of the key. It served its purpose. I need to get past this third damn boss. You're leaving the Alliance? The Alliance is still active. I just don't go in there that much. That's good shield. 20 armor. I, I never beat this fucking boss, so let's see if I can actually beat this boss now. He's doing 95 damage. Holy shit. And my armor is a little bit not as good. You've got to be kidding me. Reach maximum level with Alaric. Complete the third boss by defeating the stage boss. Well, we killed each other, and I got the achievement for it. I got him, but he got me. I've reached the maximum level with this guy before I even beat the third boss. I reached the maximum level before I even killed the third boss. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I should have done plated armor, to be honest. After dying for the first time, arrive with 50% HP and remove all debuffs. I did kill him. Well, YouTube, let's play. You can like and subscribe. Hopefully, there'll be more of this. We'll see. I'm kind of all over the place with games. There's a billion games I want to play.